In this video, we will learn about Hermitian matrix. Now, what is Hermitian matrix? It is nothing but a square matrix, okay? Such that if I take a matrix as A, okay? Such that A transpose should be equal to A conjugate, okay? So, A is a matrix, square matrix, such that this condition should, should be satisfied, okay? Otherwise, A star should be equal to A okay now a star is nothing but conjugate transpose conjugate transpose of a matrix this is nothing but conjugate transpose now this can be represented in many ways okay so a star is one way a theta you can represent or otherwise a conjugate and transpose okay or other ways we can write it as a transpose first then conjugate this is also another way to represent the for the conjugate transpose of a matrix now this is one condition this is another condition both both will be satisfied okay now here it's said to be what hermitian matrix so these two conditions you remember now this is the matrix a this is two cross two so this is a hermitian matrix i have taken now we have to see that whether it is a Hermitian matrix or not by checking the condition, two conditions. Okay. The first one will take A transpose. Okay. This way you can write otherwise A T also you can write A transpose. Okay. So what is A transpose? It is nothing but changing row with the column. Row you have to write it as column or vice versa you can do. So first row I will write it as first column. So 2, 3 plus 4i second row as second column 3 minus 4i and minus 5 this is nothing but the transpose of a matrix now next step which should be equal to what a conjugate okay a conjugate so a conjugate i have to find out for this matrix only i have to find out a conjugate a conjugate is nothing but uh, you might be studied the complex number here the imaginary part sign should change only the imaginary part sign should change now this will real part will remain as it is this is real number 2 then this is 3 will remain same minus 4i only the imaginary part sign will change this one becomes 3 plus 4i imaginary part sign minus 5 this is real so this is the a conjugate now if we compare a transpose and a conjugate of the given a matrix you can observe that this both are same correct each and every element in this are same so this is a square matrix in which both the uh, this condition is satisfied okay so this is nothing but the hermitian matrix okay so in other other textbooks they have mentioned this condition also it is nothing but a star equal to a so let us verify that also the same matrix in this we will verify a star is equal to a okay so a is the given matrix we have to find out a star a star is nothing but what the conjugate transpose okay so first i'll find out the conjugate of this matrix which is equal to so 2 this will be 3 minus 4i and this will be 3 plus 4i this is minus 5 next for a conjugate only we have to find out a transpose only. this is nothing but conjugate to transpose okay so you have to take the same matrix the a conjugate for that you have to find out the transpose not separately so for this matrix only i will find out the transpose okay so which is equal to changing row with the column that means first row as first column 3 minus 4i and second row as second column that is this one so here you can observe that this matrix this is nothing but a star correct a conjugate then transpose so a conjugate transpose now this we have found out a star whether it is equal to a the same matrix yes it is equal compare these two matrices now when you compare these two you can see each and every element even the sign are the same correct so this is one more condition you can consider so this is two condition you can learn one is the a transpose should be equal to a conjugate the second one a conjugate transpose of a matrix should be equal to the given a matrix okay and one more thing i should tell you 
observe the diagonal elements of the given matrix now this is a hermitian matrix here the diagonal elements will be real numbers okay so diagonal elements will be real numbers non diagonal elements will be what imaginary uh, i mean complex numbers okay so non diagonal elements will be complex numbers